one of the things to be on Linux in general is that you have the option to be able to customize your PC, your desktop to your liking. For example, I'm running Xmonad right here and using Arch Linux, by the way. <laughs> oh man, I feel cringe. But aside from that, I'm gonna show you my Xmonad config. If I can type it. And then we just go into Vim and I will explain to you the inner workings of my Xmonad config. Right here are your imports. And of course, you gotta start with Xmonad. And then these are all the utils that I use. I cannot really explain, but this is what I use and it's important for all of this in this config to work. For example, for the status bar, you can see where the charging and where the numbering of the screens I have on my desktop currently. You can see that I have two instances of XMO bar, so I can be able to, because I like to, <laughs> simple as that. Now, PP means pretty prick, pink, <laughs> pretty picture, so this is what gives the coloring and the, and the characters surrounding the current window or like for example, if I'm switching to different programs, as I'm on OBS and I'm on the terminal. And over here is where I have my keys, where I can be able to adjust the volume on my XMonet config. Right now, I am using Pulse Audio with Pipewire. And over here, I'm using Lux because I don't know how to use the built-in system, the lighting system in Arch Linux. If and if you can leave it in the comment section, just let me know. So yeah, this is my Xmonad config. So if you want to learn more about it, then uh, just let me know. Yeah, have a good one.